Um, I'm doing a direct upload today, which I realise is rubbish of me, and I really need to start getting better at planning ahead to make a video when I decide to take on some extra work for a voluntary lesson thing, and then cook, and then write some stories, and then don't make a video, and it's already like half past eleven on a Thursday. And I also decided to try out some rather dramatic eyeshadow today, hence the eyes. Also, my hair is red, which I think is pretty cool. And it looks a bit grungy because it's sort of dyed the blonde really red and the brown sort of auburny. But, oh well, I feel a bit like a pony that's been dipped in ketchup. Um, so I... I'm not going to make a funny video today. I'm not going to start sort of crying about Doctor Who again because while well, that is generally how I feel, it's not all of what I feel and I feel like today I just want to talk to you guys. Like, I don't know how many subscribers we have at the moment. I think there are a few, but this video is for my friends because I like talking to you and I want to talk to you and I'm not okay and I'm still sad and I don't know how many of you know this, but the week that I missed, I was in Germany because my grandma passed away and because I had to go to her funeral on Friday. And that's suckish. That's really rubbish. And I just feel like by pushing stuff away and by focusing on, like, being emotional because Amy Pond is dead or because... Harry Potter is over, or because Glee is apparently still something I care about. I'm not really feeling the right emotions, and I want to just feel the right emotions right now, which is just being sad because of my gran, not because of anything else. Yeah, so, I don't know. This video isn't nearly long enough yet, but there isn't really much else I can say right now without sort of getting into the really personal stuff which I mean I'm fine with but wouldn't make a very fun video to watch I'm just finding it really hard to sort of deal with things without not dealing with them at all because I can go to class and I can do my homework and I can watch TV and eat Doritos and even like feed myself healthily and buy books to read that I enjoy and watch films that I enjoy and get insanely emotional about boy bands because that's apparently a thing I care about as well um, but with all of that, I'm not grieving, I think, which might be a problem in that when there's the actual funeral of the urn, I don't know if there's a word for that in English apart from funeral, uh, in December it's all going to sort of come crashing back on me, and I'm not sure that I'm okay with that. And I also know that come December, I'll be in full-on big sister mode with my younger brothers, and while that's fine and while that helps me keep a lid on things it also means that I like like last week I didn't really do a huge amount of grieving for my own sake I made sure that my little brothers were okay um, during the actual funeral service I was a lot more focused in on my little little brother who's nine than I was on myself I took him outside straight away once the service was over even though personally I might have wanted to stay I didn't really talk to my parents about it because they don't deserve to feel guilty about this and I know that they would and I'm going to go over four minutes by a bit I think I'm sorry but I'm not going to cut this down any how I'm just going to talk I basically feel like I haven't really done the right thing to help me get over it I get over it's the wrong word to, but to help me even like deal with it in any way and it sucks and it means that I wake up sort of in the middle of the night with a random moment of sadness or I just think about how messy my cupboard is and then like oh well whenever Grand's on holiday here she always tidies up my cupboard for me but she won't be or I'll just be reading a book and I'll think oh I still have that book Grand gave me for last Christmas and I never read it because I was lazy or I go to look at my emails and there's still that email that I never replied to before I even knew she was ill it's just a lot for me to think about. Okay, this was a sad, rambly video. I'm sorry, I just wanted to talk, I guess. Have fun! 
Next week, I'll be doing something fun for Thanksgiving. I'll be talking about things that I am thankful for. Because, you know, why not just take up an American tradition? I will also offer myself up as a holiday stand-in. Any of you guys can't make your video, just let me know. I'm English, I don't get a holiday. I'll make a video for you. And I'll do themes or something to, like, make up for the shittiness of this week. Bye!